Hi, I'm Dr. Monica Banaktar. I'd like to welcome you to Banaktar Aesthetics, the premier non-surgical aesthetic practice in Southern California. I've developed a precise rejuvenation method called 5R Rejuvenation Method for customizing treatments that work synergistically together for stunning natural results. The first R is relax, reflate, resurface, redrape. The fifth R is retain. We will guide you through your aesthetic journey delivering world-class results and remarkable patient care. We simply settle for nothing short of superior, paying fanatical attention to every detail of your care. Hello and good evening, everyone. I am Dr. Monica Banaktar, your host for this exciting webinar. Enjoy tonight's educational webinar from the comfort of your home with perhaps a cup of coffee or a glass of wine. Um, mine is iced tea uh, and ice water. And um, this webinar focuses on my 5R rejuvenation method, a unique non-surgical method for significantly reversing face and neck aging. I hope to empower you to make the right choice for your aesthetic needs and to boost your self-confidence and happiness. My practice is called Bonactor Aesthetics. And it's a beautiful spa-like sanctuary nestled between two golf courses in Newport Beach. We are a premier aesthetic center in Southern California. We offer a comprehensive menu of facial and body treatments delivering extraordinary experiences and results. I've surrounded myself with a group of women who are as passionate as I am about aesthetic medicine. And together we transform our clients into more beautiful and youthful versions of themselves, restoring their self-confidence. We have many Google and Yelp reviews like the one shown on the slide. And a bit about me, I'm a board certified physician from the American Board of Laser Surgery. I'm an Allergan Medical Institute faculty teaching other physicians how to perform Botox and filler treatments. I'm the innovator of the 5R rejuvenation method, the Amplify filler technique, and Mon Bon clinical skincare. I love laser science and have always been an early adopter of new technologies. Because my entire practice is focused on non-surgical aesthetics for the face and body, I perform a lot more non-surgical procedures than the average plastic surgeon or dermatologist. According to the ASAPS or the American Society of Aesthetic Plastic Surgery Statistics, I do five times more Botox cosmetic, 11 times more fillers, 13 times more skin tightening, and 19 times more skin resurfacing procedures than the average plastic surgeon or dermatologist. So let's talk about what is beauty and what makes a human face beautiful. There are actually universal qualities about ideal beauty. An ideal female face has flawless skin, symmetrical features, arched brows, large eyes, a small nose, full lips, and a small lower jaw. The ideal male face also has flawless skin, symmetrical features, low set brows, a dominant nose and chin, and a white set dominant jaw. Aging is a privilege and should be celebrated. Due to innovations in medicine during the last century, we're living longer and have the opportunity to be disease-free, look good, and feel good. I say opportunity because in essence, aging is becoming optional. 
You can choose to age gracefully, which means getting old and looking old. The left photo is Bridget Bardot, an international film icon in the 50s and 60s. The right photo is Carrie Fisher, who played Princess Leia in the biggest movie franchise of all time, Star Wars, in 1977. And interestingly enough, it is May fourth which is star wars day if you didn't know so may the fourth be with you okay um you can choose to age beautifully and reverse your aging with aesthetic treatments the left photo is raquel welsh who is now 81 and the right photo is jane fonda who is 84 so in essence the 80s are the new 60s and the 50s are the new 30. These are Brazilian mother-daughter actresses who are shown both at the age of 50, Mona Delassi and Christiane Terloni. And they don't even look like they're the same age, but this is the reality of where we are today. And mothers are aging backwards and looking like doppelgangers of their daughters. Cindy Crawford and Kia Gerber are on the left. Reese Witherspoon and Ava Phillip are in the middle and Lisa Bonet and Zoe Kravitz are on the right. What happens as we age? Aging changes start very early on and at first are imperceptible. Changes pick up speed with time and are not uniform throughout the face and the neck. Luckily for us, aging changes have been studied, identified and can be reversed. Aging changes involve every tissue layer, including bone, muscle, fat and skin. Facial muscles get thinner and weaker over time and contribute to sagging of the overlying structures. Bony changes are significant and um, include hollowing of the temples, giving the illusion of a peanut head, loss of the brow ridge resulting in sagging of the brow position and the upper lid. There is widening of the eye socket, giving the um, eyes a sunken and tired look. There's shrinkage of the cheekbone resulting in flattening and sagging of the mid face. There is receding of the canine fossa or the upper teeth resulting in elongation of the upper lip area and formation of smile lines. There's significant changes on the jaw seen on profile, which I will show you. So um, not only can you see what's happening on this um, picture with the brow ridge, the eye socket, the cheekbone, and the canine fossa, look at what's happening to the once robust large angular jaw that's reduced to a smaller, almost linear jaw. This um, shortens the height of the face. Under the skin, there are a series of fat pads that make up the 3D structure of the face. With age, these fat pads shrink and descend downward, contributing to deflation and sagging of the face. I can show you a square inch of an old and a young individual skin, and you would have no trouble deciphering which is which because aging changes including color and texture changes show on skin surface. I can also blindfold you and have you press on an old and a young individual's forehead. And again, you would have no trouble deciding that the squishier, bouncier one is the younger individual because our skins become thinner, less supple and lose much of their vital architecture like the collagen and elastin that give it its elasticity and bounce. So what do you see when you look in the mirror? Our first reaction to looking at our reflection in the mirror is navigated by our emotions. Our eyes 
memorize our flaws or things that bother us about our faces. And every time we look in the mirror, our eyes are searching for the flaws um, as if they were gonna run away and reaffirming that they're still there. This simple act of looking in the mirror then starts a repeated chain of negative emotional pathways. So aging affects us psychologically. What do you want to see when you look in the mirror? When our eyes don't see those flaws, our brain's positive emotional pathways are activated and we get a boost of self-confidence and happiness. This psychologically carries over to all aspects of our lives. Even though there's a strong urge for looking good and feeling good, there are some universal fears that keep patients from seeking professional help to correct what is bothering them about their appearance, namely fear of poor results and judgment from others, fear of social downtime and bruising, and fear of pain. So let's first talk about solutions to fix what we don't like. There are surgical solutions and non-surgical solutions. A surgical lift just removes the excess skin. It doesn't address the changes associated with aging that um, I will that I just talked about. The risks of surgical lifts include anesthesia, complications, downtime, and cost. Non-surgical treatments address volume loss, skin color, skin texture, skin laxity, and overall skin health. There's no general anesthesia. There are less risks of complications, less downtime, and less cost. But how do surgical and non-surgical results compare? Up to now, non-surgical results were limited. Throughout my career, I've been selecting and curating the best non-surgical treatments. I realized that the sequence in which these non-surgical treatments are done determine the overall results. That's how the 5R rejuvenation method came about. This is a methodical sequence of curated non-surgical treatments where the total result is more than the sum of each R with the potential to deliver great results that are as good, if not better than surgical results. So keeping in mind that all patients fear unnatural results, pain and downtime, I formulated the four appointment five R's six week plan. Your first appointment is your pre five R consultation. I customize your individual five R treatment plan, medical photography is collected. I hand select your home resurfacing skincare products and perform your first R treatment. The second appointment a week later, the second and third R, which are resurface and redrape, are performed with your customized combination of high-tech treatments. Your third appointment two weeks later is the fourth R, reflate. And the last appointment two weeks later is the post-R consultation. And that's when I create your retained program. My staff and I set you up for success. You receive a written treatment plan at your pre-R consultation appointment and at your post-R retain appointment. You also receive written post-treatment instructions with every treatment that includes my cell phone as well as my clinical staff cell phone number. During the consultation, medical photography and Vizia computerized skin analysis are done. This information is used to customize your treatment and follow your progress and improvement. Vizia computerized skin analysis gives us information about health of the skin surface that include spots, wrinkles, textures, and pores, as well as skin subsurface, which include UV damage that hasn't come to surface yet, brown spots, red spots, and bacterial count. It also has a fascinating metric comparing your actual age and your true skin age which uh, at the pre-5R visit, tell us about the health of your skin before we get started. And at your post-5R visit, tell us how effective your treatment plan has been. All right, so the first R is um, 
relax. I use Botox Cosmetic to relax the small overactive muscles of the face and neck. It's best to start Botox Cosmetic treatments early because every time these small muscles contract, they break down the collagen in the overlying skin and eventually resulting in etched in lines or static wrinkles. There are four FDA muscle relaxers in US, namely Botox, Dysport, Xeomin, and Juvo, with more to come in the future. In fact, there is one coming soon that will be a six month um, uh, muscle relaxer instead of a three month muscle relaxer. I use primarily Botox Cosmetic, which is the gold standard. It works better and is more expensive than the other three muscle relaxers. I inject over 65,000 units of Botox Cosmetic per year. A full phase correction of on-label areas takes 64 units. So I do about a thousand um, treatments um, a year at least. And I'll talk about what on-label means. It's using a drug exactly as per FDA approval indications. Botox Cosmetic has the greatest number of on-label indications than the other three muscle relaxers. On-label areas for Botox Cosmetic include forehead, glabella, or the area between the brows and the crow's feet. Off-label means that an FDA approved drug uh, is used for um, an indication that's not yet approved. It's common practice in all fields of medicine to use drugs off label. As for Botox, many non approved areas of the face and neck respond beautifully to uh, Botox cosmetic, including bunny lines, lip lines the jaw um, muscle or the masseter, pebbly chin, frown lines, necklace lines, and the neck platysma bands. Here I am showing my Accubane vein finder that helps me eliminate bruises. I use the smallest size needles to minimize pain and eliminate bruising, and I call these my Gucci needles. The initial goal is to relax the overactive muscle movements or what we call dynamic wrinkles while causing the least amount of pain and zero bruising or downtime. The secondary goal is to reverse and prevent etched in lines or what we call static wrinkles. This can only be achieved when Botox treatments are done on a scheduled basis every three to four months. I think you would agree that the patients I've shown you look better and yet natural in their after photos. In my hands, Botox Cosmetic is also used for reshaping the face. This is an example of masseter treatment for ovalizing the face. This indication is already in the process of becoming FDA approved. Lastly, neck cords and necklace lines are softened with Botox Cosmetic, or what I call neck, my neck tox treatment. I always say you're buying a colorless, odorless liquid without um, a, a way to authenticate it at the time of your treatment. So instead of looking for the cheapest Botox prices, like it's uh, just a transaction, look to establish with an aesthetic provider who is committed to a long-term transformational relationship with you. All right, so moving on to our second R, redrape. This refers to treatments that tighten and lift the skin. There's been tremendous innovation in aesthetic industry in the skin tightening and skin resurfacing category. In 2000, the first skin tightening device was introduced. It was called Thermage. It produced so-so ah, results and it was painful. In 2008 came all therapy. It had better results than Thermage, but pain was still an issue. Um, even so, I still have a handful of patients who like the results of their all therapy so much that they have a yearly treatment still with me. In 2016 came Vivace radio frequency microneedling. This device had good results and was tolerable. Last year, VirtuRF replaced Vivace um, and 
it is uh, got many bells and whistles that I'm going to tell you about. All the other systems have one tip size. Virtue RF has three tip sizes. The Smart RF tip is uh, for standard treatments. Then we have this single needle tip called Exact RF that I use for treating the sagging and bags around the eyelids. And then we have the more powerful tip that um, uh, you can see the difference um, with the needles out called the deep RF and it's for debulking fatty areas like the under chin and the jowls. There are a few other redraping methods that I would like to just touch on. One of them is called subnovi plasma pen collagen induction therapy for shrink wrapping small areas like the sagging around the eyelids and the jowls. Um, this treatment has about a week of downtime, but when you look at the uh, uh, before on day one and then day seven, um, the eyelid, uh, upper eyelid looks a lot more open and tighter. The next treatment is uh, called thread lifting. The th traditional thread lifting is for repositioning of the sagging tissue of the face and the neck. And there is the smooth threads for smoothing the surface of the skin and improving the texture in the neck. This is a very popular treatment when combined with Botox cosmetic and fillers in my practice. Okay, I'm going to tell you about the fourth R and then show you before and after pictures of both the third and the fourth R. The fourth R is resurface and it uh, refers to the skin color and texture correction. These um, are the features that I follow on the Vizia computerized skin analysis. I've had many, many resurfacing devices um, in my long career, including the intense pulse light, or IPL, Fraxel, and um, Ultra Pulse CO2 laser. The game changer technology that I am most excited about is uh, the DECA CO2 laser. This laser delivers the laser energy in a brand new way that minimizes collateral tissue damage and therefore downtime. This innovation profoundly improves the patient experience with comfort and shorter downtime. Best feature of this laser is that I get to customize the treatment based on the downtime that my client is willing to have. The lighter treatment version of this laser is called Cool Peel, and I do a series of three treatments that have virtually no downtime, which means that you're swollen for two days um, and pink for three days. Um, and the stronger energy version is called Tetra, and in most cases, it is a one and done treatment with about five to seven days of swelling, pink, and dryness. Because the technologies that I use are so advanced and safe, I can perform combination redraping and resurfacing treatments during the same session. By targeting multiple layers of the skin, at the same time, I get to improve um, multiple layers and rejuvenate the, uh, the skin more thoroughly. The laser beam represents skin layers that um, the laser reaches, whereas the needle represents the layers that the RF microneedling devices reach. So in the same session, multiple skin layers are corrected, stimulating more collagen and elastin. I've created a dozen different resurfacing and redraping combination treatments. It's all about customizing uh, your treatment based on your skin health, your goals, and your downtime for tolerance. One of my ultimate favorite treatments is called the Ultimate Duo Combination. And this is a combination of Virtue RF microneedling for tone and texture improvement and um, lifting and tightening. And then the DECA CO2 laser for correction of color and um, texture damage. 
All right, so let's talk about Don Time. This is Liz, the Director of Operations at the practice, who I will introduce to you later. She is amazing and knows a lot about aesthetics. And she had the ultimate duo treatment with Virtue RF and the Cool Peel. This is the progression of her downtime. She was swollen perhaps for two days and pink for three days. Her skin was still dry on the subsequent days, but not noticeable to anyone but herself. And this is me. Um, I had the heavier treatment called Tetra. And uh, I want to point out that the Tetra delivers at least five times more energy than the Cool Peel. So it's for those who need some serious um, resurfacing. I was swollen for about three, four days, pink for about five days. I have makeup on in the last photo um, and I was still a bit dry. All right, let's go over some combination technology before and afters. This gentleman had the ultimate duo treatment. He wanted minimal downtime and he opted for the Cool Peel series of three. This is his result after only the first of the three treatments. This lovely client had a series of cool peels and um, had one subnovi plasma pen uh, collagen induction therapy around her mouth. The results shown are at one month, but they will continue to improve for the next um, six months. All right. This lovely patient completed a series of ultimate duo with cool peel and virtue and had great improvement. Um, this patient had RF microneedling and all therapy, and uh, she was extremely happy with her jowl and neck laxity improvement. Men have many of the same concerns as women, and combination therapies of resurfacing and redraping work well for men as well. Now I'm going to tell you about solo treatments. Um, this lovely lady had a series of virtue RF microneedling treatments with great improvement in lifting. Um, the deep RF had um, not yet been delivered. So now I get even better results using the deep RF um, hand piece for debulking the um, under chin area. This is pure all therapy results and pure RF microneedling results. So you can tell, I think you would agree that combination treatments have better results than solo treatments. Um, so here's some home runs for jowls. My go-to combination used to be Botox Cosmetic and Kybella. Now I'm using the Virtue Deep RF. And another um, submental fullness. Um, I used to use Kybella or Cool Sculpting, and now I'm using the Virtue Deep RF. Here is another example of what we can um, accomplish non surgically. All right, we are halfway um, to the hour and almost done with the slide presentation. And we're gonna go to uh, patient testimonials and raffle prices and the promos next. Um, so hang in there. The fourth R is called reflate and it refers to soft tissue volume loss correction with fillers. The biggest component of facial aging is the three dimensional volume loss in all the layers of the face as I showed you earlier. There's no democracy when it comes to aging, meaning different people age differently, different parts of the face age differently. One person may have more dramatic volume loss uh, in the eye hollows and another person might have more aging around their mouth. The one thing that's for sure is that aging speeds up with each decade. At first it's insidious and then one day you look in the mirror and think that you've aged overnight and don't look like yourself anymore. There are over a dozen um, different FDA approved fillers in US and more around the world and more coming to the US but I think about filler types like I think about shoes. 
and no slide deck is complete without a set of Valentino shoes. So the flat sandals would be great to wear during summer and would be completely useless in the winter. The stilettos would be ideal for a date night and the boots are must during fall and winter. And that's kind of how I think about fillers. I um, look at their characteristics and what I can do with them for the best results. I love the Juvederm collection of fillers, uh, which are actually the number one chosen filler in the world. And I use, for example, Voluma to lift the cheeks and contour the jaw. Uh, although there is a jaw contouring um, Juvederm filler coming this year. Um, I use uh, Juvederm Ultra Plus to smooth and plump and Volbella and Volor to hydrate the lip lines and to correct sunken eyes. I inject over 1,250 syringes of fillers every year. It takes an astute eye to diagnose the problem areas and I assess the face in thirds. On the upper third, I look at the forehead and the glabella lines, the deflated temples and brow position. In the middle third, I look at the cheeks. I find that the mid-face volume restoration not only lifts the mid-face, but also lifts the lower face, disguising jowls and marionettes. Um, and also I assess the under eye hollows. It looks worse than it feels. And on the lower third, I look at jaw contours, smile lines, marionette lines, and chin contours. I also assess the lip area, looking for lip lines, looking at the downturned lip corners and the actual lips. The first picture is someone who came in complaining of lip lines. That's them with a kissy face before the treatment and then their kissy face same day, five minutes later when I'm done with their um, treatment. After the assessment, I customize your filler treatment to achieve your optimal results. Optimal results require multiple syringes. Everyone's afraid of looking unnatural and looking overdone. There are enough before and after pictures um, on my website and social media that um, communicate my aesthetic preference and skills. Sometimes patients object to multiple syringes for fear of looking unnatural. It's good to remember that five syringes or five cc's of filler are equivalent to a teaspoon of filler. Some patients are not surgical candidates but respond greatly to optimal correction with fillers. So far, we've talked about the pre-5R consultation, the first R with Botox Cosmetics, second and third R with Redrape and Resurface Technologies, and the fourth R with Reflate. We're almost done. Um, let's talk about the last R, Retain, which refers to your customized prescription of how to maintain your beautiful results and protect your investment. We do this during your post-R consultation. I give you your customized plan for moving forward um, and handpick clinical skincare products for you to use daily. Um, optional anti-aging, no downtime treatments um, to do monthly, like my, just regular microneedling with PRP, um, quarterly Botox treatments and filler assessments, not filler treatments, but um, every time you have Botox with me, I assess you for, for fillers and see if there's been any change. Um, and then yearly resurface uh, or redrape assessment. Okay, this is uh, traditionally everyone's favorite part when they get to um, hear from one of my patients. Today we're talking to Carolina. Hi, Carolina. 
Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Welcome. And thank you so much for joining us. I'm so excited you're here. Can you tell us how you found my practice? Um, it was uh, my friend. My best friend goes to you and uh, she referred me to you. Wonderful. Yeah, before um, the Google um, um, business was so big, about, I would say, two thirds of my um, new patients came from word of mouth from my existing patients. Now, our best friend Google refers people to me. <laughs> so I'm still glad that my patients are referring their friends to me. And Tell us, Carolina, why did you come to see me? What um, made you decide that you had to come in? Um, I was looking for, you know, a, a doctor and I've been going to different places. And when my friends said really great things about you and your staff, I decided to come and do a consultation. Did you have any fears about coming to a new place? I mean, yes, because you want to make sure that the person is doing things in your face, they're sure. experienced, they know what they're doing. And that's what, when I look at your website, that's what I thought that you were, look very professional and plus my friend recommended you. So, and you wanted to be safe when you go to do anything. And um, I wanted to look natural. I don't want it to look like I had surgery done. So that was very important to me. And looking at, you know, the photos on the website and everything just made me feel safe to come and see you. Good. So it sounds like you have the same kind of fears that most everyone, fear of looking unnatural. Did you um, worry about pain? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> And um, downtime, did you worry about downtime? I mean, yes, of course, you know, everybody has a big, uh, busy life. I'm a mom with two kids and work and everything, you know, so it's very yeah. important to have uh, fairly no downtime. And, and uh, um, what did you end up having, if I may ask? Um, so after the consultation, you did the combination of treatments on, um, we recommend it. It was, uh, Botox filler and then the CO2, uh, laser. Great. So Carolina had a combination of the relax, reflate and resurface treatments. And, um, how were your results? I was amazed even when when my face was pink maybe the second the third day i could see the the difference like it was Great. yes it was incredible well you look wonderful thank you um, did you receive post instruction post post treatment instructions from us yes of course and i feel like you have to follow those because they're important too you know it's not just the treatment but how you treat your skin afterwards for your skin to heal and you gave like seven different products from mon bon for me to use and gave me a routine how to use it and what time that was perfect wonderful well thank you so much carolina we really appreciate you taking time out of your busy schedule to Tell others um, who may be interested in finding a new doctor that you um, have had a positive um, experience with us. You have a good rest of your evening. Thank you so much. Thanks so much for having me. It was an honor. <laughs> Take care. Bye. Thank you. Take care. Okay, so now, folks, we are going to have an interview with Liz. Um, Liz is the right-hand um, gal that works with me. She has been here forever. Um, just as excited. Hi, Liz. <laughs> she is just as excited about aesthetics that I am. Um, would you like to tell us how long you've been working with me? I think it's 11 and a half years. It's at least 11. 
Okay, great. And may we ask how old you are? I am about to turn 50. I turn 50 in, I think, a month. Oh, my. Okay, so when did you start having um, aesthetic treatments? You know what? I started getting Botox at age 29. Um, I had that angry scowl that people would ask me if I was mad all the time. Um, so I started with Botox. I um, started having some laser resurfing probably in my... I would say mid thirties um, for some acne scarring, just to make my skin look better and you kind of get addicted. <laughs> okay. And um, what have you had recently that you're just in love with? So threads, smooth threads are amazing. We did uh, my jaw line and my neck to tighten everything up and they are so easy and you see that tightness right away. So I love that. Um, the cool peel with the, um, the ultimate dual cool peel with virtue is one of my favorites. And it's one of my favorites for patients because they see change instantly. They know their skin is getting better and it looks good, but it's going to keep getting better for six months. So an instant wow is always important for patients, but knowing that it, it just keeps working is what they love. I think the instant well, along with a non-traumatic experience. Yes, yes. And, and we that's numb what you. We you are numb. Yeah. You get great numbing. So we make it as easy as possible. So it's it's just painless. You lay there and we talk to you. Can you tell them why I am so insistent on numbing, the best numbing well, in the world? Dr. V has no pain threshold. <laughs> she needs to be numb for everything. So in her mind, if she needs numbing, you need numbing. Exactly. So we invest in the best numbing products to make sure that everyone has a good experience. Yes. It may not be Neiman's or Ritz, but I still want to give you an amazing experience. Yes. Okay, um, any advice for our patients before we go to the raffle? You know, honestly, the biggest thing I tell patients is take care of your skin. You don't want to get to the point that you are trying to do it really fast. You want to stay on maintenance programs. You want to do a little something every year. Keep your Botox up so you're not fighting those lines and wrinkles. Everyone I see, I, I, I tell them, when you look in the mirror, what do you see? Let's treat it and let's get you feeling better about yourself because inner like life and vitality has to match what you see in the mirror every day so um she is our resident psychologist uh if you haven't figured it out everyone loves liz and loves talking to liz and people will literally call and say no can i just talk to liz so that's why i wanted to introduce you all um okay conclusion i have discussed how to reverse face and neck aging non-surgically with my breakthrough 5R rejuvenation method in four short visits, six weeks, while you choose your recovery time to fit your lifestyle. Thank you so much. I hope you have a great rest of your evening and we're waiting for you to call us.